Hey guys, my name is Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have a Lenovo ThinkBook 16. This is going to be the Gen 6 model, the Intel version. I'm going to show you how to get inside, access your battery. So first thing guys, power down your computer the correct way. Make sure it's off and unplugged from your charger. We're then going to flip it over to access your bottom case screws. Now you have a total of nine screws. These four along this edge here, these screws actually come out. The rest of the screws, these three on top and these two in the middle, those screws are going to stay in the bottom case even though they've been unscrewed from the, the threading. After that, I found it easiest to use my pry tool and start from the back and pry this edge up first and then work my way down the sides towards the front. I recommend a plastic pry tool because metal will tend to scratch this case a bit more. Go all the way around and if you get stuck in one spot, just leave it to go to the other side and pry it up from this seam right here. Once you get your bottom case off, this is what you're looking at for the inside of your computer. Now as a general computer repair side note guys, whenever I'm working on a computer in my shop, it's sitting on an anti-static mat. Either that or an anti-static bracelet are great ideas to avoid damaging the computer you're working on. If you need any help with any tools or supplies for your computer project, as well as any replacement or upgrade parts for this specific model, ThinkBook 16, there'll be a link above. Also below in the description, it'll take you to a list of all those replacement upgrade parts, as well as the tools and supplies you may need to work on this computer. So here's your battery right there. It's held in by five screws. You got these three on top, these two near the bottom corners. And after you remove those screws, it plugs into the motherboard right here. Now, as with any cables in a computer, try to avoid pulling on the cables when at all possible. Manipulate just the plug if you can. So this one didn't have very large grips. You can try to use a pair of pliers to grab it, but you may have to grip those wires very, very securely Try to get as much of your finger on, on the black plug as you can and gently, slowly wiggle that out to get that out. Now the battery specs on this, the Lenovo model number for the battery was an L22D3PE0. Um, this was a stock 45 watt hour battery, 11.52 volts. Now you can upgrade this battery. The upgrade version is 71 watt hour. So that may be a nice upgrade if you guys are looking to do that. I will try to have those battery upgrade and replacement options below in the description in that link I told you about with all the replacement parts. And I guess last side note with this computer repair here, if you're here because your computer's not turning on, um, no power, it seems like it's dead, you could need a new battery or it could be something else wrong with the computer. Um, I will have a video link above, also below in the description. It'll be a tutorial video on how to troubleshoot a laptop that seems like it's dead, it's not powering on, um, or you only see some LEDs here and there but nothing on the screen. I'll have that video showing you how you can fix that type of problem. But this is how you would access the battery in the ThinkPad 16 Gen 6. So that's the video guys, I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, check out the FAQs below in the description, it could save you some time getting an answer. If you do need to leave me a question or comment, please do, I do try to get to those a couple times a day at least. To support the channel, please remember to like and share, subscribe if you enjoy this type of DIY tutorials, and for those of you that want to support the channel a little further, you can always leave a small donation, and there's a couple ways to do that. First, right below the video to the right hand side, you'll see the super thanks button. You can click on that. You can select a tip amount here. Second way, you can use your cash app. Find me at dollar sign PC helper. You can leave a dollar amount and you can even leave a little note. So thank you so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you on my next video.